poison ivy has taken over the borderlands, sugar. You will need the season pass to access some of these new handcrafted loot, like the grenade mod and bat shield. Oh, Batman, he's such a joker. <laughs> Get it? This will also be reflected in the evil shop on the item's description, baby. Now let's go crash this party before Ivy comes back. What do you say, boy? Psycho Hunters, Gotham Lands has been overtaken by Poison Ivy, and our heroes have been poisoned by her pestilence. There's only one man who could have convinced Poison Ivy to do this. Evil X Jug. Ivy's acidic potion has turned Moe's into Catwoman, Amara into Harley Quinn, Zane into the Riddler, and Flack into the Joker. We must stop Jug and Ivy, and recover the Bat Shield and save Gotham Lands. We must restore the universe back into the Borderlands. Nature always wins. Will he ever learn? Evil in the Yo, I'm straight evil. Something like weasel from mob of the dead killing zombies. Yo, what's happening, YouTube Jugger here? Welcome back. To another video before we get into today's video just want to give a shout out to all you guys totally appreciate you on our way to 50,000 subscribers so right now subscribe hit that notification button turn on that bell and let's see if we can get over 200 likes this video that would be super amazing welcome to the bat villains x borderlands 3 crossover let's take a look at the items right Right now. First up, we have Moe's, the Catwoman's leech, Flack, Joker's leech, we have Zane, the Riddler leech, and we have Amara, Harley Quinn's leech. We have the Bat Shield. Ah, we also have Poison Ivy Grenade mod. This thing is absolutely amazing. We have new class mod, Zane, the Riddler class mod, Moe's, the Maiden Shields class mod, Amara's Mantis class mod, and Flack, the Bush Master class mod. Super amazing. And don't forget, we have a brand new artifact, the Ivy's Auto Idol Relic. Super amazing. And I'm going to show you guys what that can actually do as we get into the builds right now. But before we get into the builds, I want to show you guys the Bat Shield, Poison Ivy's Grenade Mod, and Poison Ivy's Corrosive Auto Idol artifact the bat shield is totally amazing first of all the design ooh, looking like a bat straight out of the cave i put so many different easter eggs in this deluxe badass snapshot you guys are gonna absolutely love it this is the first time that i actually put the amp aka what we know as the b shield right now on this shield so while shield is full you're gonna drain 30 percent of your shield to do 20 percent more weapon damage plus more now let's take a look at the decision maker bailout which is poison ivy grenade mod this thing is so superior in the way that is designed to represent poison ivy here in borderlands 3 but the power and the harness that you can pull out of this grenade mod for your character is unbelievable take a look at the annoying right now first of all the anointments is representing every single character here in borderlands 3 and not only that i put hidden anointments behind of what you are seeing for every character so this grenade mod is like the foundation for your build now for example if you're not using any of my other items for this bat villains x crossover event you can still use this grenade mod on any other weapon in borderlands 3 and still pull that harness of that power out of your character just by having this grenade mod equipped because it works for every single character bonus anointments that ties directly into your skill tree next up we have the corrosive stone auto idol which is poisons ivy stone auto idol now just so you guys know this thing actually still gives you tons of iridium and there's something special happening in borderlands 3 this weekend with iridium and especially with dlc 4 bnts today you're definitely gonna want to stack it with iridium because every single stone cryo stone 
stone, corrosive stone, shock stone, fire stone, radiation stone. Everything is built into this poison ivy artifact. We are currently playing on Mayhem Mode 10. Now where the bat shield is concerned, I actually put the red suit. So while you crouch, you're actually going to get a projected shield because I wanted the bat shield to feel like a bat suit. So while I'm putting that red suit into this bat shield, it's now a badass deluxe bat shield red bat suit. I also put XP loot booster and we have 10% movement speed while shields are full. Also your shield will absorb bullets and turn it into ammo for you as well. I know you guys love the stop gap so I put the stop gap on this as well and revenge of the bat which throws a free grenade when shields are depleted. Your shield has the ability to throw a free grenade. How crazy is that right now oh my god that's hot that's super hot i put tons of hidden abilities for you guys on the bat shield so go out there find them and have tons of fun now where poison ivy's grenade mod is concerned i wanted to give you guys the feeling of being corrupted by poison ivy so while you throw this grenade mod it will heat seek and get the enemy as it sorts out like a swarm of vines poisonous vines that are coming out of your character because you are now a dark vault hunter being corrupted by poison ivy so this grenade mod represents that and the power behind of this grenade mod is totally impeccable and it makes you feel unstoppable while dropping tons of money for you because we know dlc4 is on the horizon and i'm hoping we have upgrades because all of this money that you're getting from poison ivy you're gonna need it and this is the best way to get it to so stack up on your brand now let's discuss the builds the first build up we have is Moe's as Catwoman you guys are gonna love this build if you are a Moe's player so this is what you are looking at right now you already seen the bat shield the grenade mod and poison ivy's auto idol relic now let's get into the specifics of Moe's as Catwoman now Moe's new class mod is called the commander firewalker shield maiden I built six other class mods into to this class mod i did not want to overdo it because you guys already know balanced with a slight op is what i am always aiming for which is that fun factor and replay ability nevertheless this is still a super powerful super fun class mod as you guys can see right now i do not have any skill point spec into any of my trees because the new class mod has a whole bunch of new skill points in every single skill tree and with that blue neon square around those skill points in your trees let you know that those abilities are activated so you are looking at really Moses actually level a hundred with all of these extra skill points built into her trees and you can still spec into them with your additional skill points how crazy is that tell him way oh my god that <laughs> hot <laughs> now check this out this is Moe's weapon it's called the pestilence vicious the leech the leech is so amazing because it specs into your mind of being in that poison ivy realm leech like seed like vine like roots like trees amazing this weapon is all elemental with a primary of corrosive element and the reason why I did that is because of the green monster class mod built into this new class mod mod for Moe's which gives you that extra corrosive abilities and on top of that it stacks with all elemental effects this weapon the leech pestilence the leech for Moe's is totally amazing and check this out not only that this weapon is super powerful in the way that it shoots when you can switch from first firing mode to secondary firing mode which is totally corrosive rockets and at the same time is totally infinity so you never have to worry about ammo ah. That's on hot. this pestilence the leech the anointments are just for Moe's it specs into her trees and brings out her additional skill points and at the same time helps iron bear out 
while taking care of her ammo count. Next up, we have the Riddler. Zane the Riddler build. Now, you guys already seen the Bat Shield, Poison Ivy's Relic, and Poison Ivy Grenade mod. Just so you guys know, this grenade mod stacks with every single build for every character on their own specified leech. So, it's just crazy stackable abilities that you're going to pull out of your character to make them so powerful and corrupted that you're going to have a new gameplay experience here in Borderlands 3 with this crossover back to zany so zane right now rabble rouser rufian is his new class mod six additional class mod built into this class mod and check this out his trees are totally impeccable because this class mod gives him the ability to go from level 60 to level 100 with his additional skill points that's already specced into this tree for you highlighted in blue and those skill points are actually activated and with your additional skill points guess what you turn zane into you turn zane into the riddler because he is so powerful he likes to play games and his digi clone oh my god digi clone is off the chain senatol is off the chain barrier is off the chain you're just gonna have so much fun with the zane build here in borderlands 3. now you guys already know you see poison ivy grenade mod going all crazy here on the zane build because the bat shield is throwing out that poison ivy grenade mod reminding you guys that hey we are in full effect with this riddler build and it's just going insane there goes poison ivy grenade mod going after rackman aka batman so this is really cool just to be able to do something like this in borderlands 3 now let's talk about Zane's negating vicious the leech this is his own version of Moses leech but this is specified straight for Zany and the reason why it's like that is because Zane is cryo but I made this weapon all elemental infinity as well giving you that poison ivy slash being in the riddler mode and you can see while senatal is active movement speed is increased that is just one anointment on this weapon for zane because i put tons of hidden anointments just for zany on this weapon and with poison ivy grenade mod everything stacks so you're going to be doing some crazy amount of damage getting a new experience switching of firing modes on this weapon for zane and just go crazy with the cryo rockets uh. at the same time bringing you that new fun experience okay so we just took a look at two builds which is moses catwoman zane as the riddler now let's get into the last two builds which is amara as harley quinn now you guys already seen the bat shield poison ivy's relic and poison ivy's grenade mod now let's take a look at the new class mod for Amara, which is the Mantis, and her weapon, which is the Molten Leech. Ooh, we're getting hot in here. So now let's take a look at the Stormbringer Tiger Mantis, which is Harley Quinn, a.k.a. Amara's new class mod. Again, pulling up her trees right now. You guys can see we specced into every single tree. Again, everything highlighted in blue neon is an additional skill point into her trees, giving you more abilities. Again, going from level 60 to level 100, and you have those additional skill points that you can still spec into this tree. How crazy is that? You guys are going to love this, especially if you are Amara. You're going to feel like Harley Quinn with this build. Oh, did I tell you that when you actually activate her ability, no matter if your face casting face slamming or face grasping it actually changes elements you guys can see the elemental cloud right there is shock right now but that changes every time you use your special ability with amara so sick is that oh my god that's hot that's super hot super amazing now let's take a look at her vicious molten the leech which is all fire because harley quinn is super on fire and amara is all elemental with the focus of fire because she harnesses that power from lilith into her body as well because they are both sirens now like zane the leech and we have Moe's the Leech. This is Amara's version of the Leech, which has Face Grass, Face Cast, and Face Slam. And also hidden abilities and anointments on this weapon just for Amara. This build for Amara is totally incredible and totally fun. Now again, Infinity Pistol, shoot in the first fire mode just like bullets. Switch it up with down on the D-pad and shoot nothing but fire rockets in the mode of Infinity. Just so much super fun. And again, it's all elemental with the primary element being fire because it's amara aka harley quinzella so much fun next up we have flack 
as the Joker. I know you guys are gonna love Flack because Flack is just totally incredible. And this build right here just takes him to another level. And I'm gonna show you guys what I mean by that. You guys already seen the Bat Shield, Poison Ivy's Idol Relic, and Poison Ivy's Grenade mod. Now let's take a look at his new class mod and his new version of the Leech, which is Nuclear the Leech. Flax's new class mod is called Supercharger Bushmaster Headcase. Now the way that this thing is designed, looking like a poisonous, acidic charm, looks really, really nice. Now again, just like the previous characters, pulling up Flax trees right now you can see that that new class mod we have been specced into with pre-existing skill points on that class mod that takes flag from level 60 to level 100 i put six other class mods built into the supercharger bush master class mod for flag and it's totally incredible because all of his pets can actually use all of these extra hidden abilities and superpowers that you will get from being flag as the joker with this new class mod as you can see flag pet right now is going crazy with this class mod and those extra skill points just making him act erratic and we didn't even put additional skill points in our trees yet and i imagine if we did that what will actually happen now let's take a look at his leech nuclear vicious the leech again this is all elemental weapon just for flak with the primary weapon being radiation because of gamma burst even though as you guys can see from each anointment right there on this weapon is for flak that specs into all of his pets and they just go crazy from the rack attack from the jabber and to the iridium iridium skag and at the same time his spider ant so you got tons of different pets going on with flak and at the same time with this class mod tied in with this leech, it just turns Flax pets into something that they were not meant to be and they just go crazy. Now, I just couldn't take it anymore that I needed to spec into Flax trees with this new class mod and having the leech with that bonus radiation effect with that gamma burst and my rack attacks just going crazy. I needed to see what this iridium skag would can, you know can actually do so i just started specking into my trees like crazy to give my skag this power now let's see what this power can actually do with this class mod and leech with those bonus anointments boom pulling out oh my god you guys just seen what i did with gamma burst you've seen all of the builds combined together with the bat shield the relic the the grenade mod and then with flax build of the leech and class mod look at the devastation i just caused by activating gamma burst incredible now let's take a look at the leech really quickly you guys can see two firing modes infinity you don't have to worry about ammo first mode shoots bullets the second mode just shoots radiation rockets again all elemental using that attack command right now so my skag can kill rackman aka batman is totally incredible but what gets me is that i was actually gonna stop and cut the gameplay right here but i was like what is my skag doing look at him he's going crazy i was like in his mouth does he has rackman's head i really couldn't tell because how crazy he's acting is he did he just eat rackman's head i really can't tell you guys need to go back and let me know in the comment section because he is just behaving erratic all wild and dark and corrupted like from poison ivy this build will have flack just his pets just acting all crazy and i was like you know what he needs to calm down let me activate gamma burst and when i activate gamma burst he just went even more wild incredible and just just mind blowing just just crazy okay so check this out right now giveaway time so right now these are the builds for this weekend limited time only but right now on my channel in the comment section i'm giving away this build to six people choose and let me know which any build you will like from the most Catwoman build, Amara Harley Quinn build, Flag the Joker build, or Zane the Riddler build. I'm giving away one build to six people in the comment section right now. First, six people three on playstation and three on xbox put your psn id or gamer tag and let me know which build you will like and i will send this build to you for free 
and also next week i will bring back this build in the next video so if you miss your chance to get it this week guess what those that missed out can actually have a chance to get it next week as well for free and if you miss your chance to get it right now this weekend you can actually go to my shop and purchase we it. have restocked finally the shop has been restocked so go out there Get your bundles right now if you would like in evilxjugshop.com. Link in the description. First link in the description. We only have a limited quantities available. So get it while it's hot. And again, please put your PSN ID or gamer tag at checkout so I can get to you. Again, delivery can be anywhere between instant to four days this weekend because I'm going to take on a little bit more orders so you guys can actually have fun because DLC 4 is on the way and you guys need to any up on your loot because these handcrafted items they're not going to be here for long so you got to get it while it's hot because we are moving on because we got dlc4 on the way and we got to get ready for that new content with this new loot oh my god so much is happening in borderlands 3 let's get it so remember until next time treat yourself don't cheat yourself i'm jug love you guys to the fullest and i'll see you here for another one peace Properties securing the flag with extended match. Take your name to your brain like Scorpion's chain. Taking your money ain't leaving no change. Even evil can evil couldn't stop this yeah. man. He is evil next juggernaut, the son of Sam. Damn, yeah, man. Reveal your secrets, Crystals. Huh? <laughs> 